by Madeline Mendoza, mysanantonio.com published 11.18 a.m. Central Standard Time, Thursday, January 24, 2019 at official Bears, Q2630, the rose and catches the pass, and steps twice before coming to a stop. As mentioned in a previous tweet, a moving player may catch the ball and take a 1-2 to stop. This should not have been a traveling call. As mentioned in a previous tweet, a moving player may catch the ball and take a 1-2 to stop. This should not more photo, Mitchell F. Getty Images photo, Mitchell F. Getty Images at official Nbirfs, Q2630, the rose and catches the pass, and steps twice before coming to a stop. As mentioned in a previous tweet, a moving player may catch the ball and take a 1-2 to stop. This should not have been a traveling call. As mentioned in a previous tweet, a moving player may catch the ball and take a 1-2 to stop. This should not. More photo, Mitchell F. Getty Images NBA referees respond to Spurs fans' Twitter questions on officiating during loss to 76ers as the Spurs took on the Philadelphia 76ers in Wednesday night's away game. Fans took on NBA referees during the the Twitter-based event provides spectators the opportunity to discuss officiating with league referees in real time by tweeting their questions to the at official Nbirfs account with the hashtag. While well, NBA referees Curtis Blair, Mitchell Irvin and Tom Washington position themselves on the court, another set of officials were live tweeting the calls from their perspectives at the replay center. Find out first, get San Antonio breaking news directly to your inbox fan bases of both franchises chimed in, challenging the officiating throughout the game. Spurs fan at Spurs underscore legacy contested Jonah Baldin's guarding of LaMarcus Aldridge during the second quarter. The fan included a photo to show the 76er touched Aldridge's arm as he went up for a hook shot. Where was the foul call at Spurs underscore legacy demanded to know? Related, Spurs fan with Kawhi Leonard, snake emoji posters issued an NBA warning card for verbal abuse, the responding referee admitted contact was missed and Baldin's block was not clean. The account also said a traveling call on DeMar DeRozan should not have been made a few minutes before the missed foul on Aldridge. On the other hand, the referees said players, like DeRozan, fool them. Fan it can underscore you. Dig underscore it asked why a foul was called on Ben Simmons while guarding DeMar DeRozan in the third quarter. This play is one example of what is difficult about our job in the moment. There is contact by Simmons, but he doesn't push DeRozan down and it is marginal, the account responded. Occasionally the players can fool us, which we see later when we watch the tape. Despite having seven spurs in double figures, the team was not able to withstand the 76ers' last-minute 10-0 run and finished the night with a 122-120 loss. Madeline Mendoza is a breaking news reporter and general assignment writer. Read her on our breaking news site, mysa.com, and on our subscriber site, expressnews.com, mmendoza at mysa.com, at Mataski.